How are we doing folks? Back out. So, it's another wet and windy, dreary day. That will no stop me. So, I'm going to... Well, as you can see, I'll get the, the wind trigger this smoky hot up again tonight. Probably stove. What I'm going to do, I'm going to prep some wood, as I always do. Or since I need to get stoked up for tonight. Uh, and then... Well, and I record this, I don't know when I'll post this, but it's a Friday night, so it's cider time. A couple of ciders, I'll cook some to eat later on. I don't know what I'm going to cook yet, so you just have to wait and see. So stay tuned. Anyway, I'm going to cut some wood. So, I'm going to go on that. Wood's prepped, uh, flight is now, uh, but I'm not going to it'll be dark, so probably when I start filming again it'll, it'll be dark, but that'll be later on. Well, might have a bit more filming while it's still light, but probably the time I get around to uh, get a lot of food and get a cider cracked open. Uh, or maybe the dark night or but stay tuned to the night shed you it's all went dark so let's get the stove on we'll get that cooking done oh yeah Right, cooking wise, what have we got tonight? A wee concoction, but I'm sure it'll taste fantastic. So, I've got three shallots, a tomato, a couple of cloves of garlic, some diced potato, and I've got Mayflower curry sauce mix. So, we're going to have a wee cheeky cheating curry tonight. I'm saying cheating curry because it's not chicken curry. I'm cheating because I'm not making the sauce from scratch. But this is great stuff, this. Just a bit of boiled water, boom. Before you know it, you get curry sauce. So we'll fry all this up first. We'll boil the water up for the curry sauce. Pour it all on. And then jobs are good and stay tuned. Oh, almost forgot. A couple of chilies as well. Just to add that wee bit of kick to it. Oh yeah. I'm going to chop all that up on. It's a great wee thing. Uh, I actually got this. I, I bought one of the cheese boards you buy. And this came with it. So I thought, I didn't just buy it for the cheese, I just thought, 
that's actually quite a nice handy wee chopping board. So that's what I'm going to use to chop stuff up. So let's go on with that. Stuff by magic. Yep, all the veggies chopped up. So shallots, chilies, garlic, tomato. Let's get this frying pan on. Let's get cooking. What's cooking in Karen's kitchen tonight? Right, first done. Oh, should I do camera work? Potato. So we'll fry that off first. Potatoes fried in a bit, so time for the shallots, garlic, chilli, tomato. Lovely stuff. So we're going to cook that down a wee bit more and then once we've done that get the curry sauce flung in it as well Oh you know it's going to taste great Right, take for a bit of curry sauce So I don't know if we've just got a tiny wee bit too much water in there So, oh, good thing about this, I'm going to chuck it in. Right, yeah, I'm actually in a bow. Right, and what we're going to do is Oh, this is going to taste so bad. Oh yes. Oh that looks immense. So give that another I don't know, give it another five minutes. And I think that'll be good to go. Oh, that looks delish. I'd say that's good to go. So, you know what time it is. It's taste time. Potato curry in the woods. Fantastic. Oh, that tastes absolutely superb. Right, anyway, I'm going to dig in. Bring it back in a minute. Didn't last very long. Mm. Bon appetit. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that was good. That was real good. Right, time for a brew. So Friday night, soon the hot scent, tomorrow night I'll go live, before I do that, it's time for a uh, 
dairy milk. So we have a wee cheeky dairy milk from a, from a brew. So I was watching a wee bit of Monty Outdoors live tonight. I think everybody's getting in and out of these live shows, especially during lockdown. Not much else to do, is there? Oh, a big thanks to to James Cambridge as well, guy that won the tent. The one in the backwards bungalow in my giveaway. He just sent me through a. Uh, I keep getting asked a bit. The, the sound quality. As I, well, not everybody says it, but I think the one person saying. Trying to hear what I'm saying. So he's kindly sent me through uh, a dead cat. I don't mean an active dead cat. Sorry, I'm eating this chocolate. Uh, it said it's a dead cat microphone. And it looks quite a good thing, so. James, cheers, mate. Top man. I've also got a new, uh, a new hot tent. Formerly have sent me through another hot tent, so I'll need to get out and I'll maybe do like a, an unboxing setup video of it first. I mean, I can do it and spend a night in it, a few nights in it. I might even get it up tomorrow night, but we'll wait and see. I might just, uh, I might just stick my old formula up for a live show. I don't know what else to be like tomorrow. I'm going to try and do the video. I'll do it in the light so I can show everybody exactly what it looks like. So I think it's the the Manta. So looks pretty good. All their tents, all probably stands, so I like them all. And their stoves as well. But I'm going to try and wait for a dry day. And then I'll, I'll put it up then. That's it for the night. I think I'm just gonna undo my, my bed and crash out for the night. So, as ever folks, thanks for tuning in, thanks for watching. Hit the like, subscribe, hit the bell, you know the score, if you haven't already. And there's 4,100 and last time I looked 70 or something folk have subscribed so big thanks to you all make it all worthwhile and hopefully hopefully he's managed to, to tune in for the, the live Saturday shows it was always a good laugh 8 o'clock Saturday night be there or be square right folks I'm off right I'm off to my bed well if I drink this too then I'm off to my bed so Adios, amigos, catch you in the next one.